haters can't stand me like their legs broken. <laughs> Call the corner, cause DJ Truth is taking it to the streets. So, famous radio Bezos Hour. Shout out DJ Yakor for, for hooking us up with the DJs and the artists and everything. Let's go in. I think I got your boy DJ Truth on the line, so I'm going to bring him on right now. Yo, 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 what's up? It's Bezos Hour. What's popping, man? What up, though? <laughs> DJ Truth checking in, West Philly represent a worldwide uh, international phenom. What up, DJ Yakor? That's my man, yo. Good luck for hooking me up. What's, right what's going on, Drew? Yes, I told him <laughs> earlier, I'm, I'm turning into such a media whore in 2010, so uh, let's, keep, let's keep it going, brother. Let's keep it going. I feel you, man. DJ Truth, man, it's, it's, it's a blessing that you're all here, man. I really appreciate you taking time out your busy schedule to, you know, just to interview uh, do an interview with me, man. I really appreciate that. Um, oh, for sure, for sure. I wouldn't uh, want to turn it down for the world. Anytime I get a chance to talk to the world, talk to the people, and, you know, just vent on, on the way uh, I'm seeing hip-hop in 2010 and, you know, some of the situations that we run across in the last few quarters that that really um, changed the way I, I look at music. Um, Folks need to create their own lane. Everybody's so quick to make a fast buck. You know what I'm saying? And they're not respecting the craft or the art of hip-hop. You know, and there's a couple of artists, I guess we could say, that's not really doing that and everything as well, too, man. I, I ask all all the artists and everything, well, not all the artists, but all the DJs that I interviewed, um, you know, Lil Wayne said, fuck DJs, pretty much. <laughs> I want I want your take on that, but I want, I want, to, I want to ask you basically, like, you know, there's no more respect for the people who actually break records and stuff. And when Lil Wayne said, you know, fuck DJs, I mean, I know DJ Yakor was living. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yes, sir. He's like an yes, Anton sir. Wayne guy. Uh huh? Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, you know, those words, fuck a DJ, or, or showing hatred towards a DJ, knowing that these are the DJs who, who put you in prime position. To, to make the money that you make, to be the celebrity that you are. Um, I got a chance to talk to uh, one of the guys who was a, a part of the actual lawsuit uh, that Lil Wayne had initiated, and he was flabbergasted. He just was outright, couldn't understand. And to this day, I mean, once I, I got wind of that, um, I, I barred his music from my crates for a long time. Uh, mm -hmm. I may today sneak a little Wayne song in and only if it's asked for specifically this is the song I want to hear but other than that he's out of my rotation Gucci Man is out of my rotation and, and, I, and, and I'm the DJ who ha I have no problem getting on the microphone and telling a thousand people that not only am I not going to play Gucci Man tonight I'm not going to play Little Wayne either or Beyonce <laughs> as a matter of fact but I know for a fact that most ladies hate Beyonce. So, <laughs> or most of the ladies that I party with. So, you know, these, these guys, and, and Gucci got out of jail last week, and at, I, I'm waiting to hear this public apology. He fired, yeah, his, oh management, uh, he fired his management team. He, he's shaking up the grounds at the, at the mansion. He's going to make some changes in his career. But at no right. time in this, in this couple weeks has he made that public apology on behalf of the company that sued, that were, were willing to sue Coast to Coast mixtape DJs and these mixtape sites for promoting him and his music. And I'm still waiting for that. And until I hear that, I'm not playing Lem Lemonade. I'm not playing, I don't even know what other Gucci Man song. That's the only one that comes to mind. But um, you know, until I hear that apology, I'll continue to, to be the voice along with Yakor to say, we're not going to support you, the artist. We're, we're going to take your spins away. All right? right. We're going to take them away. As fast, as quick as we can give them to you, we can take them away. And people need to know that DJs have that power. We have that power to do that. 